Hey animal enthusiasts and pet hobbyists, it's Joel here again. And as you can probably see by the thumbnail, my rose hair tarantula unfortunately passed away. Now, I knew that he died because I saw him on the corner of the water bowl and he was with his legs curled up. And I know the difference between telling if a tarantula is about to molt or if it's dying and usually when they molt they'll be upside down with their legs curled but this guy was on his belly with his legs curled in and uh yeah that's when i knew that something was wrong i moved the cage i tapped him a little bit but nothing no response I knew that his time would be around the corner because we've already had him for eight years already and males typically don't live very long. Females could live up to 20 years, but yeah, we sexed this guy. We found the hooks on the frontal limbs and he's kind of small compared to other rose hair tarantulas. Females are typically larger. But yeah, it's really sad because I remember having him when I was in elementary school. I'm in high school now. Those were the days. So, yeah. Kind of want to preserve the specimen. Because I, I don't think I'm ever going to have another rose hair tarantula for a while. And it's pretty cool. But yeah, his name was Harry. Harry the rose hair tarantula. Fed him crickets, super worms. But yeah, the time. I don't know what those little white spots are. They look like debris. I don't know. But yeah, guys, I just thought I'd let you know that you probably I won't be making any other tarantula videos in the future because of this. But yeah. Thank you for watching.